Listen, I have taught this many times and, and I am sorry that some people's feelings might get hurt because I know it's not the most popular thing to say. But there's a lot of prayers that you make that are not supposed to be made. They are pointless. The problem is we do things because we were taught but we don't question them and look at them in light of scripture. Listen, the Bible tells you that God protects you, protects you by his angels. There is nowhere you see the apostles in prison and it is angels that are breaking them out. You see men, battles rising up against the people of God and angels are coming to fight. But the church doesn't even know the place of the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus was for protection against God to you, not the devil. Let me give you an example. In Egypt, the Lord told Moses, tell everybody to put blood on their door. For the angel of death shall come at night and he shall slay anybody that has no blood. Who sent that angel? So when they were putting blood, who are they protecting themselves from? Not the devil. If you read the book of Revelation, it says, they overcame him by the blood of the lamb and the word of their testimony. But you don't understand what he's talking about. When the Lord Jesus came, he came and gave us victory against sin that the devil used to put on our neck because he used the law of God against us because of our sin. The blood of Jesus came to remove sin so that God cannot be angry with us and the devil cannot accuse you. Because when you do wrong against the law and somebody comes and points out, Lord, that person messed up. Why are you not punishing them? Are you not just? God is forced to enforce the law because you are on the wrong. The only way God could fix it to protect us from him was for him to come down himself because he could not trust anybody to be able to do it the way he would do it. So he came down himself, died himself for himself, went back to heaven, took his blood, put it on the mercy seat so that he cannot look at us anymore.